We didn't find, we didn't find Shongile, but oh my God, I am going to die. Herbie, I can't believe you found such a small thing. I don't want to get too close because we're going to spook it, but look at that tiny little baby. That is a baby mongoose, dwarf mongoose by the looks of it, and I'm sure it's just busy looking for its family. Oh my goodness, that is so sweet and so tiny. Oh my goodness. It's just busy squeaking, so it's clearly looking for its family. Uh, dwarf mongoose are one of the smallest carnivores that we have in this area. And they don't get too big. This one is still not even fully covered in fur. I can see its tail, it's just still a bit um, without hair. I'm sure it's gonna... And I just wanna point out to you guys just how small it is. I'm just gonna quickly put my hand next to it so that you guys get a bit of an idea so it could very easily fit in my pocket this is how tiny this little creature is there. you see just about this big oh my goodness it's such a tiny little thing i'm sure it's just busy looking for its family there is a termite mound not too far away from us, so I'm sure maybe the rest of the band is somewhere around here, just waiting for it. Because from a small age, they start moving around, they go from one termite mound to their next house and so on, because they cannot, or they will not just stay in one mound all the time, they'll rotate and they'll go through others. I think the rest of the family is just around here, so we're gonna leave this little guy because I just want to make sure that the family does come and get him. I don't want to stress it out in any way. So we're gonna leave this tiny little creature all by itself. The, um, we've spotted the family not too far away, so hopefully he's just gonna go back to where it came from. All right, while we leave this tiny little one over here, I know it's still not Shangile, but it, quite, a, quite a unique sighting. This is the first time I've seen such a tiny one out in the open like this. Let's go back to James and see what he's up to.